Hello my sugar plums, it's your girl Tatiana Brown here and welcome back to my YouTube channel and I know it's been a while, I had a vacation last month on November and through November 15th through 17th and I went to Myrtle Beach and I had a good time, had a good dinner and I had a good place to stay in for a vacation and I recharged my crystals around the vacation. It was a good time to have them recharge in the sunlight and water, the beach water at the beach. And I just felt really good about it. I really miss Myrtle Beach so much, so much. And I just really want, I want to go back and have a vacation again. Because it was a positive vibes only that I want to have in. Because I just need that vacation. I need a vacation. And I just miss going on vacations for a long time. And I know it's been a long time since I never had one. Only when I was little I have vacations. And a long time ago. Until. Well, anyways, today I'll be telling you guys about the books I got. This one here is Wild Power, Discover the Magic of Your Menstrual Cycle and Awaken the Feminine Path to Power by the founders of Red School, Alexandra Pope and Sanjani Hugo World Lizard. Uh, or... Roll it, sir. <laughs> I can't even pronounce the last name right. Sorry about that. And it talks about the spiritual meaning of your menstruation. The, when your wild power lies in the rhythm and change of your menstrual cycle, it just shows the spiritual meaning about it, of your menstrual cycle. And the book I got is Moon Power, the lunar rituals for connecting with your inner goddess. It talks about your zodiac signs and moon goddesses and women. And it also talks about celebrities in it. And your lunar power, lunar superpower and creating altars and all that. And your full moon rituals and new moons as well. And it also talks about ancient god moon goddesses in the past history. And it talks about moon in, in every zodiac sign and spirit spirit animals as well. So this book is made by Simone Butler. Thank you, Simone Butler, for this book and I read this and I finished it last time I, and I finished this one time and I'm thinking about rereading this again sooner or later anyway because this book helped me learn about the moon magic and the moon and zodiac signs and all it helps me through that and uh, I got my first oracle cards. You know, it's like tarot cards and all. I even got I, I got Moonology oracle cards by Yasmin Boland. Thank you, Yasmin Boland, for this first for this cards because it's my first time having them, and I read them like two or three times. And use them to to do this because it helps it also helps with the moon energy and and it has a guidebook in it so thank you so much miss Yasmin I'm pretty sure that you keep up the good work and you and you are a good magnif magnificent woman 
So thank you for these cards. Now I appreciate this. I really appreciate it. And uh, I got The Power of Shanti by Padma on Prakasha. It talks about your inner Shakti, 18 paths to ignite the energy of the divine woman. It talks about when you, about your Shanti or whether the Shanti goddess, Shanti is a divine life force that ceaselessly manifests, creates, and activates. And it also talks about Tantra yoga you know tantra yoga and it talks about the wounds to link the chakra and your sacred and your sacred sexual center and heart center and even tells you about your sacral chakra so thanks to her too And I got, I also got Your Goddess Year by Sky Alexander. It talks about, it also talks about your goddess years that you are born in and whether, and whether you do rituals to invoke them as well. So thank you, Miss Sky Alexander, for this book here from Amazon. And I appreciate I could read this more about it later on. So thank you for this book. And this is Evolution of Goddess by Emma Mildon. I started reading this book long ago last month, I think. I started reading this last month or October, even though I haven't even finished reading this, which I need to do this later on or sooner. So this is a book I got. So this is a book that was delivered from Amazon as well also and you can see I got the bookmark in it I got my bookmark in it just so I won't lose a page it says never let your mind speak and let your heart do the talking never complain on the littlest of things your mind can't handle it that was my favorite bookmark and books and my bookmarks were also delivered from Amazon too. So thank you for this book, Miss Emma. And this is Orisha's Goddesses and Voodoo Queens. The Divine Feminine in the African Religious Traditions by Lilith Dorsey. It, it, it's also from Amazon as well, too. And it says in the back, unlock the ancient and powerful mysteries of Africa's Feminine or Feminine Divine. In the back, as you can see the red words... Above, above, and thank you, Lilith Dorsey, for this book, and, and and it talks about your, it talks about the Orishas, you know, African queens, and African goddesses, and voodoo, and it talks about one of the most voodoo queens is Mary. Lavender or or Mary Laviu. Mary Laviu is one of the most voodoo queens that was 
that was approaching the history in the past. And I appreciate this book. And I haven't even finished it as well. Because cause I just need to take a break from it. I, I, Cause I just need a lot of breaks from this books, and the laptop, and all that. I know I've been having a lot of busy day, and sorry I stutter a lot. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that will read all these books and finish them sooner. So. So here that I'm talking about today is new crystals that I got from the crystal store and Amazon. Sorry about that. Uh, this one new crystal is Pink Agate. And this one is for your heart, I think. Because Pink Agate, I haven't read the meaning of this Pink Agate. So I had to read it again somehow. Sorry about that. And this one. Uh, and this one is Cornelian. Well, they were all delivered. I, I had a lot of Cornelians from Amazon. As you can see here. Because they are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And I knew I got a lot of Cornelians. So I got, it, so I got to improve. My sacral chakra. And this one is yellow obsidian. And, um, uh, it's hard to choose one of these. And this one here is Spiderweb Jasper. I got two of them. So it helps you connect with somebody. This one is Bumblebee Jasper. I just don't feel like reading the meetings of the crystals right now. And therefore, I had to... Remember the meaning of the crystals somehow. So sorry about the mistakes, cause cause I'm getting the coughs after the sinus problems I got that I had two days ago. I had sinus problems and I just don't feel like reading the meanings of the crystals, but. But but my sinus problems are go away. To, well, my sinus problems went away today and yesterday. Cause, cause I use medicine. Cause I do my medicine and teas. That will help me get better. And and I got coughs after sinus problems. Just the coughs today. And yesterday after sinus problems so sorry I can't so sorry about that anyway I'm pretty sure I'll I'll read the meanings of the crystals to you next time on the next video and be sure if you like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram, Tatiana the Chakra Girl. Follow me on Wattpad, DeviantArt, and, and Inkit.com. And see if you could find me on Inkit.com because I already logged in and never, and haven't even used it for a long time. 
and and follow me on Twitter too. That's Chakra Tatiana twenty. And be sure you and be sure you comment down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, my loves.